Hi Air Signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out what does your person plan to say to you next. And this is a love reading, so this person has to be connected to you romantically in some way, shape, or form. <clears throat> and also, this is a collective reading for Air Signs. And if you were divinely guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same Air Signs. Um, let's get a reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for air signs. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. What is the person going to say to air signs next? <clears throat> wow. Not once at the bottom of the deck. <clears throat> so your person could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, or a Leo, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus with the Knight of Pentacles here. Got the sun here and well first though. And also we've got the lovers. I see two different storylines here. Just take what resonates with you. For those of you air signs, if you've been cheated on by your person, your person is going to say to you next that they are sorry with the uh, page of cups here. Sorry for putting you in a third party situation with the lovers here. And maybe the hermit here feels like they've grown up. They may say to you that they've grown up and that they would like to offer you commitment here. And that you are their true love and they would like to step up. With the emperor here and um take responsibility over what they have done in the past and six of cups here my first not going to repeat something from the past and they are really unhappy to have hurt you or give given you stress here with the nine of uh, swords here in my first only for those of you if you do know your person is cheating okay but uh or has cheated and air signs, if this is someone new, I'm sensing some of you, this could also be somebody new because we've got the Ace of Cups here, right? If this is someone new, I feel like this person is going to say to you that they're choosing you and that they do love you. They find both of you to be very compatible. And after some time of thinking, reflecting with the Hermit here, um, they feel like they can finally open up, open, open their heart and express to you. <clears throat> that they would like to commit to you with the Nine of Pentacles here. They would like to offer you a cup of love. They may say to you that you are their true love or that they want to have a new love beginning with you. The Emperor here, they may say to you that they have consulted this from with their dad or somebody of a father figure, somebody older than they are, somebody that they respect. And they also agree that you could be the one for them. They may also say to you that if this Emperor is them, they may also say to you that they would like to be a responsible partner to you. The emperor is a lifetime partner, so they may say to you that they see being with you long term. The six of cups here, my verse, um, they may also say to you that whatever in their past here, something, some unhappiness in the past, or if they have an ex, they're not returning to their ex, they're not going to speak with their ex anymore. Um, yeah, that's what I'm getting here. They're going to be offering you love. They may also apologize to you a little bit about maybe their behavior in the past or something that they have said in the past. If this is someone new, but I feel like for most of you, they're going to be saying something very positive uh, to you because I think they have, <clears throat> with the hermit here, either they have thought about it, reflected on it. Or that they've asked some advice from someone that they trust as someone that they respect, okay? We're going to pull out more cards here as signs. For those of you, I've got some people complaining about my voice, how I'm like clearing my throat and it's annoying. Hey, I'm human. I'm not a robot, okay? Drink some water. <sighs> I... Do they know? Do they know that that's a very simple thing that anybody can know and 
know what to do, which is to drink water. If their throat, it's obviously not just about drinking water. I have a sore throat and some allergy issues, so whatever. Anyway, I'm just a little bit upset with this stupid comment. Anyway, um, I think it's not from air signs. It's from uh, an earth sign. I think it's a Taurus or a Virgo, something like that. All right, but anyway, sorry, I'm just ranting. So I've got the King of Cups here in my verse. Ace of Pentacles and the world here in my verse. I feel like this person is going to say to you that they are sticking around and they're going to end their singlehood or that they are on their way to... You know, feeling ready, getting ready to being in a relationship with you, a serious relationship with you, or take the relationship to the next level, depending where you're at with your person right now. And I feel like for most of you, this could be someone new, unless this is someone whom has cheated on you or <clears throat> has done something to you, right? With a sun here, my verse, and a nine of, nine of swords in my verse. That's made you really, really unhappy. I definitely see them feeling very motivated with the Knight of Wands here to offer you love, to offer you an apology, to tell you that they are straightening up, they are stepping up, and that they are serious this time around with the Ace of Pentacles here, offering you a new beginning. They're going to express to you, King of Cups here in my verse, they will say to you that they're going to open their heart and be vulnerable. Um, they may say something vulnerable to you as well. Something that has made them really unhappy with the sun here in the verse. And they're not going to play around. <clears throat> they may also say that they want to end their bachelorhood, bachelorette, whatever. He or she is not gender specific. But that it wasn't very happy or emotionally fulfilling for them to, you know, have multiple people or to have flings or to not have a meaningful relationship. So I feel like they may feel that uh, you are the one who could um that they could build a meaningful relationship with okay it could be also well I, I feel like this part could apply to those of you if you are separated or if this is a new person so i'm sensing a person is going to say to you that they are ready they are ready for a very emotionally fulfilling um meaningful relationship with you and the will of fortune here in reverse it's like they're sticking around right uh, the world in reverse and the wheel of fortune in reverse. Yeah, they're sticking around. They um, they want to continue on this path, on this road with you, on this chapter. They want to continue on, and also with the Ace of Pentacles here, or you know, start another chapter with the Ace of Pentacles here. It's like maybe both of you are already in this right now, and they just want to continue and continue to build. And Ace of Pentacles, they may say to you that they, they wanna get married <laughs> because the ace of pentacles there is a pentacle here so it could indicate a ring so they may even e e either offer you a ring or a promise ring or or just promises okay saying that they are for you they are here for you and that you are the one for them so i'm really happy to see this actually just give me one moment okay so i'm gonna pull up more cards here sorry my phone just the phone on my side that I used to time myself. It just suddenly went blank. But anyway. Um, I'm seeing the Queen of Swords in my versus your energy. <clears throat> if uh, if you're separated from your person, if your, par if your person did make you really unhappy, I sense that they are going to say to you that they understand, they get what, they, they get it. They get it. They, they're putting themselves in your shoes. They understand why you could have been really unhappy. And it makes them really unhappy and vulnerable as well. The King of Cups here in our verse. That they may say to you that they've been sad. They've been crying a lot. And if there's someone new, they may say to you that uh, maybe in the past, you know, so there, there was some unhappiness. Made them feel like it was hard for them to fall in love with you. Uh, or, or to fall in love again. But they're realizing now that perhaps... They could open up and fall in love with you. I feel like it's a chance that they are taking. And they don't mind it now because they, they may feel like... I, I, sen I sense that they do trust you, okay? They do trust you. Or that, again, they may have gotten some advice from um, someone that they respect to give this connection a chance. Okay, so... Um, but if you're separated from this person, they may say to you that they are stuck. They haven't moved on yet. Um, that they would like to commit to you, yeah. 
Um, they want to be the father of your children, the mother of your children. If both of you haven't have, if both of you don't have kids yet, but if you both, if both of you have kids already, they may, they may finally say to you that they want to be a responsible father or a responsible mother. Okay, they choose you to the pentacles here more first. Feels like you are going to be chosen by this person. They may say to you that they would like to start on this new journey with you. The page of wands here. They may also tell you that, you know, we're going to travel, like there's some sort of a plan here in regards of traveling, leisure, and um, yeah, honeymoon, I'm hearing honeymoon, could also be an engagement, marriage as well, alright, air signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, this is your reading, hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form, if you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe, I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now, the first one is from my second channel, it's a travel vlog channel, check it out if you want to, and the second playlist is from this channel, it has all of the readings that I've done for you, and for the rest of the signs, for different topics and different questions, but these readings are still new, so they're still relevant, um, so check it out if you want to, and I hope to see you back here again tomorrow. Take care, Air Science. Bye.